So for this rig, I'm gonna take a size six apex beaked point hook, mega sharp, um, a length of stiffy, chod stiff filament in 20 pound, and a, a tiny little screw bait ring swivel. So first off, I've cut around 12 inches of the stiffy filament. Take your size six hook, and align the material with the back of the shank. Pull it up so you've got a little tag end and create a loop so that the long length goes back toward the eye, like so. And then all we do is go. to kind of gauge it by depending on what size hook what, what size hook bait you're going to use um, if you're going to use a small hook bait sometimes you want that D to be a little bit smaller so that you don't want too much you don't want too much of a gap between the swivel and the hook and sometimes if you're going to use a bigger bait you want a slightly bigger D to give you a little bit more room um, for the bait to be able to move about a little bit, bit more. But in this case, we're gonna pull it down to give you an average size D. It's about there. And all you do is literally whip the material back up on itself three times and then back through the eye like so. And then take your puller tool and just pull that down. That's nice and tight. And all we do from there is just pull that out a little bit. And there you have 
can have a nice tidy D. Now once you've got to that stage, all you do is you tie an overhand loop in the end of the filament, depending on how long you want your, your section to be. In this case, I normally have them around about six to seven inches long. So I like to tie a figure of eight loop, especially with these particular materials, because it exits the loop nice and straight, gives you a nice straight exit, um, and it just sits really nice on that, on that material. So there you have it, a nice stiff hook link section with a D tied there, perfect for nailing those very tricky and wary carp. Thank you.